Hello, wrestling fans. I am Mud Puppet Joel. He is Mud Puppet Ryan. We are the Mud Puppets right here. Caleb Stills and Aiden Prince locking up there. Getting at it quick. This one from September 21st, 2015. MPW Fallout. Expect a uh, very technically sound matchup between these two gentlemen. Well, you know, Aiden Prince uh, has wrestled in MPW before. Uh, nearly two years ago, he almost upset Jamie Cox in a match. So uh, we'll see if he can uh, use some of that same quickness uh, to, get a, get a, to get a jump on Caleb Stills here. It looks still John with the fans a little bit. John with Prince now. See a lot of talk during this one. Fans, the opponent, the official. Caleb Stills continues that, that, that mean streak. And uh, along this path. This new persona he has carved out for himself. You know, the man used to wrestle his gutter. He used to basically grab any chair or table or whatever he grabbed and smash someone with it. He became a more refined, more technical wrestler, going to fight his given name, Caleb Stills. But we're starting to see more of that old mean streak come out of him. He's got a save draw on it. He's a fan of that. He's going to help his career. So it's, it's almost a blend of the two. And I, I think I agree with you here that uh, it may be a boom. For Mr. Still. Like that they're putting pressure on the throat and using uh, almost the whole count that the referee gave him before the disqualification. Need a moment. Need a moment. Well, you know, sometimes that thing happens when you need a battle. Gotta uh, recover mentally or physically, whatever the case may be. Oh, straight boot to the midsection there. Aiden the Prince finds himself in a bit of trouble. See if he can maneuver his way out of this one. Like this here with the wrist lock. And I like seeing Caleb Stills. He's going all over, working every part of this young man's body, trying to really uh, dismantle him. Yeah. So then again, find a way to ground your opponent. And now they're going, ooh, tried to nip out of that one, could not. Prince kept him down, now smashes the forearm onto the mat. Now applying pressure to the neck, snaps it back again, and again the arm down to the mat. So Prince is coming right back at Caleb Stills, picking him apart. A veteran move from this young man. Caleb Stills has had a stand in, but sneak out of it. Punch straight in the mud. Gotta love it. If it's effective, it's effective. Back in the center of the ring, still back on the offensive. So these two just going back and forth. So I'm pinned behind the back now. Reversal. Ooh, just a straight forearm to the face of Aiden Prince. And Prince gives it right back to him. He's got to give Aiden Prince some credit. He is matching Caleb Stills here, move for move. He is, he's going to whip Caleb in, Caleb Stills reversal, Prince up, looks like, I mean, jams his face into the turnbuckle, holds it up with a nice kick right in the chest. Veteran move there by Caleb Stills to recognize Aiden Prince's next move, and sidestep him. Shot to the chest here, and that sounds throughout. Rookies bar and grill, another chop there. And Prince comes right back again. Oh, guys, not much of a counter for, for, for that. Maybe. No, not not at all. If you can't see, you can't defend yourself. Whipped off the ropes now. Takes a swing at him, misses. Prince here, air drive, puts him down. Oh, oh. He's got to be careful here. Oh, power bump into the turnbuckle. Pops him square between the eyes. Prince down to the mat. And Aiden Prince is moving with great speed, but you've got to wonder sometimes if that doesn't work against him. I mean, what's my wrestler can get ahead of himself with a move? His opponent is smart enough and has the experience. He can take advantage of it. He can see the other guy doesn't have complete control of his body. Look at the power there. Deadlift. Caleb still drops it. Right across that knee, and Aiden Prince is feeling that deep in his gut. A, a guy, especially a smaller guy, comes in, um, you know, rel relatively, he's not a newcomer to MPW, but hasn't wrestled here often. You, you give him some credit for, for going toe-to-toe uh, -to -toe with uh, one of the stars of the promotion, but there is something to be said for not being caught up in all of uh, the spectacle and, and the hype. You don't want to... You don't want to play to his strengths, and you want to stay on top of your own game. Yeah, and that's what a veteran like Caleb Stills is capable of. He makes you forget your plan. 
makes you wrestle the match you want. Now again, he's talking to the fans, he's talking to the ref. He's showing a lot of disrespect to his opponent. Shoots some head stomp there, and Prince fires back several times here with some rights. He still going back and forth now, exchanging blows. Come out of this one with this exchange on top, it looks like it's going to be skills again. The knee came in hard and fast, right in the side of the jaw, and that's a good way to dislocate your jaw. Chop, and like he's just going to slice A.G. Prince in two, he comes right back with a shot to the abdomen and a couple chops of his own. Now he hits the ropes up and over. Can he get Stills down for the pin? And no, does not look like that. Stomp. Baked him out with a fake punch. Stomped him in the stomach. And again, playing up to the fans. I'd say these two had each other well scouted prior to this one. The submission hold. Archie back, he's got him in the camel clutch now. You see the pressure on the lower back, the pressure on the spine, pulling back on the chin, putting his weight down. I, I like I like this strategy here. I did not see uh, a, a real grounded submission hold for quite a while on this one. Good time to test your opponent so you can get what you can. Stills put down the mat, front face lock applied by Prince. Quickly out of it though. And again, they're ex exchanging shots. This one may come down to who can take a shot and draw the best. They both can shoot. Ooh, wee, he almost put him through the mat with that one. That could be a thing. Prince one and two and kick out. And he reverses into his own pin. One, two, and nearly got him. And now Stills is looking to put him in his own finisher. Can he apply it? No. Prince back to his feet. So many times we've seen Caleb Stills victorious with that face lock. Any opponents are that guy. Ooh, it's a dangerous maneuver. Game Prince is going to have to do his best to avoid that. Oh, and again, he looks still. John has a chance. He is not like it, but the fans are saying to him out there. He's been, he's been a little a, a little erratic the last uh, year or so, uh, where his relationship with the fans is concerned. Oh, oh, to the head there, to Game Prince. That was just nasty. Um, unless there's a big swing of momentum, I think Aiden Prince uh, may be wearing down that. Suplexes him off the apron, back into the ring. Well, see. A lot out of Aiden Prince, too, though. He's on pulling those ribs. They're still feeling the damage. Movers. Caleb Stills is used on him. And the turnbuckle up and over. All right, the living room. Swing by Stills. He misses. Another forearm there, and then right across the apron, puts his head in the turnbuckle, he's going up top. High risk, high reward, gets him with it. And if he could have gotten to the pin, that might have been it. Staggering back to his feet is Stills. Prince charges him now, puts a kick into his face. Now he has him set up here, this could be it. Oh, Stills gonna elbow out. It's the rope. Impressive wow. aerial assault there. Prince turned himself all the way around with that one. A moon salt and he nails Into him. Into the pin, this should be two and just barely a kick out. Wow, you're seeing quite a match here, right? Yes, indeed. I think if Prince had hit that moon a little more flush, it would have been, it didn't quite catch him with all of it. I don't recall the maneuver that preceded it. It looked like a, a one-legged uh, uh, drop kick into a, into a flip. It was impressive. It looks still catching him here, though. And you saw he just it slipped. He got a little too overzealous with these these aerial maneuvers oh. and simply power bomb to the mat. And I think this this should be it. Oh, oh driven, devastated. Dropped him right on his neck too, and three. And uh, uh, we talked about it earlier. Aiden Prince is, uh, I think, his his own enthusiasm and energy. He got ahead of himself there. Yeah, he did. He got caught up a little bit there in the, the power bomb followed by that vicious double underhook pile driver. And uh, Aiden Prince is going to have to go over to Rookie's Bar and uh, get himself a shot or two to, to come back from that. I think. Uh, a very competitive matchup, and in the end, Taylor still was able to take advantage of the mischief. Oh, that pile drive, that underhook pile drive finish we saw there as well. That was a thing that's huge. Pretty vicious, especially following the power bomb, and he really made sure to put the man away. 
Well, fans, as always, we'll be back again next week with some more wrestling action. We are the Mud Puppets. If you'd like to check out our guest comedy, and we would like you to come on over and be a subscriber. We also have a YouTube channel, The Mud Puppets. All of our videos there. You can also check out our website, mudpuppets.com. What video do we want to give the fans this week? How about a little classic? Oh, a little classic. classic. Well, you know, it's going to be wintertime until it snowed in. Oh, a great classic snowed. video yeah. from earlier this year. Oh, damn. Yes. Yeah. Damn day. Right. Caleb Stills walks up, calling the fans some more. We'll say goodbye for now, and we will see you once again next week.